my name is Michelle and it has been a while since I have made one of these unboxing videos. If you are one of my followers that added this channel and found me through one of my unboxing boxes, welcome back. I haven't been subscribing to a lot of fashion to home services because I wasn't very happy with some of the boxes that I was getting. I was making these videos but ended up not posting them on the internet because I was just very disappointed with the product that I was getting and rather than bash the services I decided to take a long break. Since then of course and this year as it has for many of us my fashion needs have changed. I got really into selling on Poshmark some of the clothes that I had in my closet that I just wasn't using or didn't need anymore um, and it's been a long time since I've actually purchased any clothing at all. I bought one one shirt around my birthday and since then haven't bought anything because I mean pants are optional some days honestly this week with it changing into fall I decided to give another Amazon Prime wardrobe a try all lounge clothing here and going through Amazon Prime and picking out this box for the items that go into it it definitely reminded me of all the reasons why Amazon Prime annoys me and why they were not my favorite fashion to home service. I thought it would be a good start for me to jump back into this. I was not using the Prime Styling service for this, specifically just Prime Wardrobe where I picked out my clothes. So I picked eight items to go into this bag. I stuck to um, Amazon brands. Um, they're a little bit cheaper and in the past I have bought clothing from Amazon brands and they've held up. One thing that I do for Amazon Prime wardrobes, and I'm sorry that I'm a little bit all over the place, it's been quite a while. Um, I will tell you the price that I ordered the clothing for, but look for a link below to the clothing um, because prices on Amazon change quite often and sometimes the prices for this clothing that I ordered will even change before I actually check out. So that's something that you have to be super mindful of. I have a whole video of tips on Amazon. Check it out if this is your first time experiencing Prime Wardrobe. It can be a little bit overwhelming, at least it was for me, but you know. Okay, this is positive. I'm actually looking forward to trying all of these on. Let's get to it. First thing first, this is the romper. So you can see the I didn't think I was going to like this romper, but it's very comfortable and the color is good. Um, and it's perfect for working at home, I think. It's very easy and breezy. Um, not a huge fan of rompers, just because you have to take them all off to go to the bathroom. But living at home, working at home, it's different. So this might be a contender. So next step is this little lavender top. I love it, very cute, great color, easy to wear. And then the Core 10 um, leggings, which are also very nice, kind of like a compression legging. They're, they felt almost too tight when I was putting them on, but then once I got them all pulled up, they do feel like they are the right size. Um, I probably wanna do a couple of lunges make sure that I have full movement in these yoga pants and of course have somebody check to make sure that they aren't see-through before I bought them. Um, but yeah, this is very comfortable outfit. On to the next top. Here is the hunter green tunic in a small, it has a deep slit over on the side. Hopefully you can see that, which is fun, nice, like that. This is completely the wrong size for me. It does not fit up here. The arms are super tight. So um, I do like this shirt, but I would definitely want to get it in a medium. It doesn't work for me completely up at the top, but I do like this breathability. I like that it goes with the yoga pants really well. So definitely interested in trying this shirt in a medium. I think the only reason I got it in a small is because it wasn't available in a medium. So. Next top. All right, this is a comfy top that I definitely feel like I could live in. The material is stretchy, it's comfortable. Um, I like the high neckline, um, you know, with something going on up there. So I definitely could see myself just enjoying this top at home, lounging as we move into fall and winter. So this is a contender. Here is the crisscross top. Um, this one feels a little bit warmer than the space dye tunic that I tried, so the material must be 
and act like I shouldn't be acting like I know anything about material because I do not. Um, it, it is a polyester viscose blend, so vis viscose sometimes makes things a little bit hotter. Um, I love the crisscross detail on that. Hopefully, you can see it. Matches the pant crisscross detail very well. It's very comfortable. Great working at home. Shirt again with the high neckline, perfect for Zoom meetings. Another contender. All right, and here's another little t-shirt um, in that space dye gray color. This one has a pocket, unlike the lavender one, and it feels heavier, more of that yoga material than that lavender shirt does as well. This is another comfortable top that goes great with the yoga pants and is perfect for lounging at home or working at home because of the high neckline. You could throw a blazer over this really quickly depending on the meeting that you needed to be in. All right, one more top. All right, this is the last top. This is now a Core 10 head to toe outfit. This top is by Core 10 and I think it's adorable. It's super comfy. I love the ruffles. That adds a little something special to it and this is just enough to feel like you actually put real clothes on working at home while also being super comfortable, in my opinion. Um, I like it a lot, and I like the color. You know, it's not like all the grays that you saw with the other things in the box, um, because this was one of the items in a color my size that I was actually able to pick. So I have very hard decisions here because everything's very comfortable. All right, let's do a boxer. I had a lot of fun. It was fun getting to try clothes on back in my house. The clothes that I received from Amazon, I like them all a lot, actually. I'm surprised that I liked everything. There were some items that I wished were in different colors, but that's about it. The quality and the feel of a lot of these items I feel are going to hold up while I continue this working at home experience. Um, if you are working at home, let me know what some of your favorite lounge items are so I can check them out. I'm not sure if it's, I'm just excited because I haven't bought clothes in a while or if I just really like everything. So I'm gonna take a few more days to sit and settle with all of that. Um, but the price actually is pretty good, like I said, for this box, it's eight items for $220. There's no discount on that, unfortunately. Um, but when I think about if Stitch Fix was to send me a box with five items, after the discount it would probably end up around that same amount of money. But I'm also open to checking out to see if I can find some of these things on Poshmark, gently used. Um, and that's it. Like I said, this is my first video back, so I'm not totally back in the swing of things. Thank you so much for sticking around and checking this video out. And I'm not super great at these videos, like I say in every video. So thank you for being very nice to me in the comments and I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.